These five nations all lived very similar, roughly a thousand years ago. In this dark period of our history, it was full of chaos. And by that, I mean, the people were doing poor. The people were having a lot of warfare. The creator saw this and it made him sad. Near the Bay of Quintes, born a boy to a virgin mother, was given the word of the creator. As he grew up and became a man, he decided to spread this message of peace. And he came across Lake Ontario to the territory of the Ganyan Gionok people. So he built a fire and where his smoke went up, those Mohawk people sent runners there. They took the beads and they went to their leaders. They brought him in and they had him climb this great big pine tree. As he's climbing, they're cut in the tree and it goes falling off the cliff. And you know, the next day came and in that same spot where his camp was, there was smoke again. And this time they brought him back and they listened to the whole message. They says, we want to think about it. And so the peacemaker left. He came next to the Utneotka people. He did the same thing. The Utneotka people listened to the message, also wanted to think about it. The peacemaker came to a house that was by itself, climbed up on top of the house. Helwenta was a great warrior, is living in the outskirts, so turned on his own people and all people. Helwenta came back and he was cooking. The peacemaker's reflection showed up in the water. But Helwenta looked again and he saw his own reflection. He sat in a corner of his house, upset. He thought to himself, why am I like this? The peacemaker gave Hayawenta his message. Guyana's hat go well. And Hayawenta listened to it. Let me help you spread your message. He, the speaker for peacemaker. Together, they went to Atotaro. Someone sent Atotaro poisonous bird. And when he plucks the tail feathers out, that poison is activated. It changed everything positive about him to negative can't even be recognized he made himself the ruler of the onondaga people atotaro he situated himself on an island controlling the weather and made a great storm their canoe to flip over they decided they should get some help they come into the territory of the atotaro trying to do all that he could to stop them. He had one of his helpers, a pack. Hey, I went as he got into this canoe, he didn't take a paddle with him. He just floated around all over. He was just devastated. And he sees a bunch of fresh water shells. He starts to collect them. Pretty soon he's got a big pile of these shells. The peacemaker is looking all over for him. Comes upon a house again. That's all by itself. There lived a lady and she's cooking up a storm. Warriors, show up. You can pay me for this food. And how you can pay me is telling me your war stories. And they finish their meal, they keel over dead. The peacemaker, he goes in there. Oh, she says, oh, Sadakoni. Oh, you can pay me. Telling me your war stories. He says, I have no war stories. And he tells her, Guy in his hat go off. I'm gonna bring these five nations into a house of peace. I accept that message. It makes sense. Jigon Sase, new face, spread this message of peace and became the mother of nations. Hayawenta, he's making these strings of beads. The peacemaker finally catches up to him. You suffered a great loss. I'm gonna help you. I'm going to condole you, if only for one day. Use this wampum, remove the lump from your throat, restore your vision, clear your ears. Now you can 
be restored, continue to Seneca territory. The Anandawak got people, turn them away. So they go back the next day, they take a single arrow and they break their arrow. And they take the five arrows this time, and he tries to break it and he can't. The peacemaker demonstrates in unity is strength. Anandawak got people accepted in his head. And they go to see Atutaro, they're singing a song of peace. They use that wampum and they comb the snakes from his hair. They restore Atutaro back to being a human. Atutaro, since you're a new man, we're gonna give you a new name, Tadudaho. Tell everybody, bring their weapons of war to come to Anundat Gate. Throw your weapons of war, the bad feelings in this hole. They buried it. He planted our symbol of peace. Well, so at go, uh, this peace was started and the people prospered. We had a way of keeping our history straight and passing it on is told in wampum.